There's been a bit of a shake-up in the world tour because the bike sponsorship merry-go-round has well and truly happened between 2018 and 2019. Let's have a look at who's using what. The squad of Adje Desar Le Mondial have changed after two seasons with Factor Frames and Forks to the Belgian brand Eddie Merckx, who make a return to the top level after Quick Step previously used the brand back in 2011. That's not the only new thing about Adje Desar though, because now they're using Campagnolo group sets. Bars and stems now come from Deda Elementi and tyres by Vredestein, who make a return to the world tour for the first time in quite a while. Rotor power meters replace SRM and KMC chains replace Shimano. Astana have been using Argon 18 frame sets for the last two seasons and continue the trend in 2019. Wheels, just like in 2018, are Corima, and Astana remain the only team in the World Tour using that brand. Group sets are Shimano. For 2019, they look to be set on Wolfpack tyres, but previously we have seen them use multiple brands in one season. Bahrain Merida enter their third season of existence and naturally continue to use Merida frames and forks and the group sets there from Shimano with the exception of the chain set because the squad actually decided to use the Ultra Bling THM clavicula models with the integrated SRM power meter. Wheels they're provided by Fulcrum and they're wrapped up in rubber from Continental. For the third year running two is Bora Handsgrower and the frame sets of Specialized and group sets of Shimano. Wheels, they come from Roval, who are the wheel brand of Specialized. And tires, they too come from Specialized, as do the handlebars when using the aero bike, such as the Venge. Otherwise, the squad can be seen using bars and stems from Pro, who are actually part of Shimano. A new squad for 2019, CCC. Now this team came to life from the BMC racing team, but BMC didn't decide to carry the sponsorship over. Instead, Giant stepped up to provide the frames and forks. Group sets provided by Shimano and the bars and stems are just like the frame, Giant. And wheels, they're labeled as hashtag overachieve, which is something I spotted a few times last year at races. And the tires, well, they come from Vittoria. Dimension Data is a fitting team to come after CCC, as Dimension Data are using the brand BMC for their frame sets in 2019. Group sets are Shimano, with the exception of the chain set, which is Rotor, and the chain, which is KMC. Wheels are Envy, who have been with the team for a number of seasons now, and Vittoria tyres finish off those wheels nicely. And finally, as Stooped Saddles, they've been replaced with Celia Talia for this year. And we were very privileged to be able to film the 2019 bikes of EF Education First Pro Cycling as they were under a strict embargo and with plenty of prying eyes while well, we had to go undercover. The team, they have largely stuck with the same setup from 2018, so that means Cannondale frames and forks and Shimano group sets and vision wheels. The change though is that this season the power meter is no longer SRM, they've made the switch to power to max. Not making any changes for 2019 is the team of Group Armour FDJ, Lapierre frame sets, Shimano group sets and wheels, and the wheels, well, they've got Continental tyres on them. Group Armour FDJ are one of the few teams to not have disc brake bikes available to their riders, but after speaking to staff, they have been trialling a few, so keep your eyes peeled. Another team making no changes for 2019 is that of Katusha Alpesin. SRAM continue to provide group sets and Quark, the power meters, and the wheels, yep, they stick with zip, and they're wrapped up with continental rubber. Frame and forks come from Canyon, as do the finishing kits of the bars, stems, and seat posts. Now at this point, we're going to run through some of the UCI women's teams that were at the Tour Down Under. Now with there being 37 teams in this category, not every team was represented at the race. So we looked at as many of these teams that we could. Rally UHC make the change to felt frames and forks after using Diamondback for the past couple of seasons. Head continue to supply the wheels and they have Kenda tubulars fitted to them. SRAM are the group set supplier along with Quark power meters. Team Tipco are using Fuji frames, Shimano group sets, and interestingly, a Praxix Works chain set. Edco supply the wheels and Maxis the tires. Oval are the bars and stems, as well as seat posts, and Prologo provide the saddles. 
The Italian squad of B Pink are using frames from Italian brand Chemo with Shimano group sets fitted to them. Ambrosio supply the wheels and they're fitted with Schwalbe tyres. Deda Elementi provide the stems, bars and seat posts. The Astana women's team, just like their male counterpart, use Argon 18 frame sets with Shimano group sets and also Corima wheels with FSA finishing kits. The differences between them and the men's squad are that the women actually use FSA chain sets and Veloflex tyres. The Mitchelton Scott women ride on an identical setup to the men's outfit, so Scott frames, Shimano group sets, Shimano wheels, Pirelli tyres and Syncross bars, stems, seat posts and saddles. The Belgian squad of Doltecini Van Eyck Sport are using Willia Triestina bikes with Shimano group sets fitted on them. Fast forward wheels with Vittoria tyres and Ritchie finish it off nicely with bars, stems and handlebars. A new team for 2019 is that of CCC Live and the team that includes 11-time world champion and two-time Olympic champion Mariana Voss they will be riding live frame sets fitted with SRAM components, Giant wheels and Vittoria tyres. And the handlebars and stems, well, they're supplied by Giant too. The Mexican squad of Swapit Agualico were a late invitation to the women's tour down under, so didn't have their latest bikes. But for 2019, they are using Zero Uno frames and forks fitted with Shimano group sets, Vision wheels and Maxxis tyres. Now it's time for the final nine men's teams. Jumbo Visma are sticking with their tried and tested setups and there appears to be just one change. Remaining with Bianchi frame sets and the group sets and wheels, sticking with Shimano. Tyres there from Vittoria. Where the change comes for 2019 is the power meter. Previously, the team hailing from the Netherlands were using the Pioneer units, but for this season they've changed to Shimano, but interestingly stuck with the Pioneer head units. Another team with no change is the Belgian squad of Lotto Sedal. Belgian brand Ridley continue to provide the frame and forks and Campagnolo the group sets and SRM the power meters. Wheels are Campagnolo with tyres from Vittoria. And well, Deda Elementi remain the sponsor of the bars, stems and seat posts and topped off with Selly Italia saddles. Australian squad Mitchelton Scott are not bucking the trend here, again sticking with the same setups from the previous year, which means Scott frame sets, Shimano group sets, power meters and wheels, and tyres are from Pirelli, who made a return to the cycling scene a couple of years back, and the bars, stems, seat posts and saddles are all from Syncross. The Spanish team of Movistar and home of current world champion Alejandro Valverde stay with the same setup of 2018 for 2019. Canyon frames, forks, bars, stems and seat posts and Campagnolo group sets and wheels. Power to Max, they continue to supply the power meters and Continental the tires. Patrick Lefebvre's Wolfpack will be riding virtually the same bikes as in the 2018 season. A couple of small changes though come in the electronics department. The team have swapped from the 4i power meter to Shimano's power meter and the GPS units are Brighton who make their first entry into the World Tour arena. Frame sets continue to come from Specialized as do the saddles, wheels and tires. Ceramic speed bearings are tucked away inside of the components where they can be and well Shimano provide the rest. The Grand Tour Specialist squad of Team Sky are remaining to use the equipment that has seen them win all three Grand Tours. Pinarello are the brand behind the frames and forks and Shimano are now a full group set sponsor, including power meters, having taken over fully from stages after we saw Shimano and stages share power meter sponsorship for a year. Wheels are Shimano and tires Continental. Pinarello's in-house brand Moss provide the bars and stems. As of yet, we've not seen Team Sky race on a disc brake bike, despite having one available for their use. We've got a big change now. Team Sunweb, who were using the frame sets of Giant, have made the change to Cervelo for this season. Tom Dumoulin's squad will be on board the new S5 disc, as well as the R-Series frame. The most striking difference about the new S5 is the presence of an external steerer tube design on the fork, not to mention the Y-shaped handlebars. Group sets are from Shimano, as are the wheels, and the tyres, they come from Continental. 
The squad of Grand Tour contender Richie Port remain on Trek frames and forks. The big change though, well that comes with the group set as the squad make the move from Shimano to SRAM. Wheels and finishing components are sticking with Bontrager, who are part of the Trek brand. And just like in 2018, the team will be using Vittoria tyres. And finally, the UAE Team Emirates squad are continuing the use of Colnago frame sets and forks for 2019, and it's very much an Italian affair for the equipment choices. Campagnolo group sets and wheels, Vittoria tyres and Deda Elementi bars, stems and seat posts. Saddle? Well, it's got to be Italian, so Prologo is their choice. The biggest changes in the men's world tour this year comes in the area of group sets. Shimano have lost two teams, so drop from having 14 squads to 12, and SRAM gain a team, meaning they now have two teams. And Campagnolo, they've gone up to four. So there we are, the 2019 World Tour of Bikes. Let me know your favourite down in the comment section below and why. Personally, I'm going to go for CCC for the kit and BMC for the bike. Don't forget too to like and share this video with your friends. Share it with someone who absolutely loves bike tech. Don't forget also to check out the GCN shop at shop.globalcyclingnetwork.com. And now for another great video, how about clicking just down here?